I just wanted to show you this project that I made um, quite a while ago, um, and I don't believe I did a video on it. Um, I'm going to go back through and make sure that I didn't do one. Um, but anyways, I want to show you what I did with this project. Um, so I just took an old um, clock that I found at a thrift store, and I actually just took it apart. Um, how I did that was there were some screws in the back that I just um, went ahead and took out. And on this project, it actually cut my hand pretty bad because it had a um, some type of like thing inside that was wound up for the clock. And when I took it apart, my finger was near it. And when it spun off um, of there, it hit my hand and cut my finger. So just be careful of that when you're taking apart old clocks. Um, they've got you know, some mechanisms in there that can um, cause some damage to your hands. So just be careful and keep your fingers um, kind of out of there <laughs> when you're doing it. But what I went ahead and did is I painted it with white paint. It, this was just like a gold, an ugly gold um, clock, little alarm clock. And I painted it white and then I used some Tim Holtz ink to ink, ink it this um, pretty turquoise color. It's kind of one of my favorite colors and I use it a lot. Um, and then I put some uh, gel medium over top of it to hold it all down. And it kind of gave it this um, texture that's um, kind of like gluey. So I like it. It holds it all in there. And it, you, it really brought out the color. Um, before I put the gloss on it, it was a little bit matte. And then once I put the, the gel stuff over top of it, it just gave it a lot of um, color. And um, so I really like how it turned out. Um, what I did is I went ahead and added a little bit of jute twine to the top um, there. And then the image inside is from my scrapbooking group. We um, used to share some images that we had. And I just printed it off with my printer. And um, so I like how that turned out. And I just fussy cut her out and popped her off with some dots. And this is the original dome that was on there. And I would open it, but it's kind of really hard. I actually glued it shut. Um, <clears throat> and then I put some little um, flowers in there. And I can't remember what brand those were, um, but I think I got them at Michael's. Um, and then I added some of these gears were from the inside of the clock. Um, and I put those in there um, just because it makes it look clockish. <laughs> And I really like how it turned out. And I just added some Prima paper to the background. And um, that's basically what I did. It wasn't a lot of work. Um, but it just is something cute to set on a counter. Um, it's just like a little shadow box. And you could put anything in there. Uh, you could do some really cool stuff. I've made some Graphic 45 ones. Um, this one just happened to be kind of more simple. And I just wanted to focus more on just that photo of that really cute hairstyle and stuff. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you like this project. Please like and subscribe. I'm getting really close to having a thousand subscribers and getting my monetization back. So if you could subscribe, I would so appreciate it. Um, and uh, thank you guys so much for watching. Have a great day.